Get your shit together, big home. You already know what time it is. This is the AO Nation donation conversation where we find out who is in the comment section capping and who is really walking like that. And I hate that word capping. Or that's cap. That's cap, nigga. That's cap. Um, of course, we're here on the uh, beautiful rap trap set. I'm AO Conseco, obviously. Fearless leader of AO Nation and the Man 2 Movement, but you already know that. And we're here to celebrate and show respect to the members of the nation who felt so strongly about a message that came through a video that they saw this month that they had to go into their pocket and put their hard earned This is my favorite show of every month because I get to see what I was putting out there. This is the list. This is the fucking list. Every month. Every month, this is the fucking list. Let's get down to it. Number one, top of the fucking morning is Keith Day, the OG senior squad fucking captain. Uh, he says, you my brother for life. Just realize you way busier than I knew. Peace, player. I'm so happy for your success, bro. Keith, you already know what it is. Keith Day is um, a day one fucking member. Um, he's out there in D.C. Um, and that's why I couldn't write the rest of your message down, Keith, because... Um, you know, they have to go to the Patreon to find out um, what, what was going on with that. But um, shout out to you, Keith. Real talk, my nigga. You already know what it is. Keep moving, my nigga. You know what it is. Um, number two is HBGENT. HBGENT. Um, they don't leave a message, but they definitely show love. HBGENT. Um, I wish you would have said something about something, but y'all know if you're a business um, label artists, um, and you're trying to get, you know, promo on this show, you gotta do 20 or more and shit like that, uh, but they didn't out, so I don't know, but I'm assuming it's some type of, uh, record label, but appreciate that, my nigga, real talk. Uh, Ronnie Collins, Ronnie Collins, Ronnie Collins, that swim fan, he always coming through, habitual supporter, Ronnie doesn't leave a message, but he show love. Swim fan, I appreciate that. Real talk, my nigga. You know what it is. Mellow Jones is back in the motherfucking house. Mellow Jones says, thank you for all your videos and thank you for being authentic. Love. I appreciate you for allowing me to be myself to where I don't have to jump up and down and do a fucking Irish jig or pretend like that gangster shit is still something that I want to fucking do. So I appreciate you for fucking with me being myself. Because for the longest time, these people where I'm from showed me that I was not liked, wanted, or fucked with. Um, so to hear people from all over the country and the world say that, you know what I'm saying, they fuck with me being myself is it's fucking mind blowing, honestly. And y'all need to let that be motivation to whatever the fuck you doing. I always speak on this, but you just have to remember this shit. Like those people at home are going to smile in your face, but you're gonna go to your fucking social media and they're not gonna share anything that you put out. They're not gonna like anything that you put out. They're not gonna comment on anything you put out. But once you succeed by going elsewhere, they will be like, oh, yeah, I fuck with you. You know, just, and it's, it's lame as fuck, but that's just how it happens. You're going to have to brush that shit off. Don't let the motherfuckers in, but that's just going to be what it is. I man, uh, if you fucking could see the, some of these motherfuckers that are sending me friend requests and just acting like nothing happened. 
Like, and, and, and to a point, a motherfucker might feel like, I'm like, yeah, get over it, okay? You were walking down the street, okay? Who the fuck? I'm sorry. You must not have never been through shit because when you going through that shit, my nigga, that shit feels like forever. It feels like forever and you remember every fucking thing. You remember everything. Also, the good. So if you down bad and nobody come through, somebody can come through just for one day and just shoot you twenty dollars and you be like, I ain't never gonna forget that. But it goes the other way too. You walking down the street with your work uniform on and a motherfucker pass by you and don't honk the horn, don't do shit, and you know who in the call, and they, they obviously know where the fuck you work at because you they seen you at your job. Say you work at McDonald's or some shit like that. They pass you the fuck up and don't say a motherfucking thing, but now you get on a motherfucker like, oh shit, oh boy, you know I've been for with you. I used to always fuck with your damn McDonald's and shit like that. Or they, they won't say it like that, they send you a fucking friend request. Like, what the fuck? Are you trying to spy me or some shit? Like, are you serious, my nigga? I'm never gonna forget that. So watch how the fuck you treat people. But also, remember, if you down bad, you going you have to come up. So that means all the other shit that you're doing, those distractions, those things that are hindering you from getting to that level where you can look down on the people that look down on you or... Because that's, I mean, that that's, that's I was motivated. I'm like, I'm going to shit on these motherfuckers. It wasn't like, I'm going to get on and I'm going to help it. Nah, hell no. Nah. Man, I'm going to get on and shit on these motherfuckers. These motherfuckers do me like this, man. Nobody help. Nobody. But that, that's, you know. That's what the three S's are for. But shout out to Melo Jones. Ranville King, another habitual supporter. Ranville says, uh, salute to you, my nigga. That's all he say. That's all he had to say. Ranville is a habitual supporter. You always gonna hear Ranville name. Um, Manuel Ortiz. I want to say Manuel. Okay, it says read the phone. So he must have left a big message. Manuel has something to say. Yes, Manuel, Manuel Ortiz. Man, I hope this I hope this message don't got no mention in it. I told y'all if you don't want to be mentioned, put no mention at the beginning of your uh your note. He said, "What's goody, Ayo? I was watching your Chief Keep uh, Keep Child Support episode when you go off on the tangent. You speak some real shit and be keeping a nigga motivated and reminded me of what I'm thinking or used to think, but should be thinking." at the moment. I'm just showing love. Keep doing your thing. By the way, I'm the one who uh, went in the street. Wasn't a mistake. Just showing love. But send that to my email. Manny Music. He want me to send went in the street to his email. Manny Music. Um, respect, hey, yo. Man, yo, I appreciate that shit, man. And I will be sending that winning streak to you. Um, and it's crazy that you say that about me going off on them tangents because you just would not believe how many, you know, people in the comment section will start saying that bullshit. Like, he's not even on, like, this new people is like, why the fuck are you here? I'm going to go all the way off of this fucking subject. If you don't like motherfuckers going off the fucking topic, if you want me to, on May 5th, this rapper was shot on the 15th Street of 26. My nigga, I'm talking to you. I'm not these fucking bloggers. I'm a nigga that been through some shit that's speaking to you. And when I'm giving it to you, you really need to be soaking up all of it. Unless you're just a lame-ass internet nigga. And, and if that's the case, then I, I see why the fuck you would be... Um, you just want to know about the subject because you never going to experience shit else. Like, you just always going to be a nigga in front of the fucking computer. 
Shout out to my nigga Skull. Shout out to my nigga Sonic Fox. Real gamers. But they not lame. So, if you don't like a nigga that go off on tangents, round this bitch, that's what the fuck we do. And the people who support me and show love, they fuck with that shit. How the, why the fuck would I change what I do for motherfuckers who just in the comment section? The fuck, man, that, that shit to be blowing me sometimes. Like, he's, he fucking, he, he fucking, he didn't even talk about the fuck. I don't give a fuck about no goddamn rapper. Talking about you, what's going to help my people? Motherfucker. But shout out to my man, Manuel Ortiz. Love to you, my nigga. I appreciate all the love. Um, obviously, this ain't your first time showing love. I appreciate it, my nigga. Real talk. And you, you really show love, too. Um, Irvine Vic. Irvine Vic says, keep doing what you're doing, big homes. You know I'm going to do it, Irvine. I hope I'm saying that name right. Irvin. Yeah, probably Irvin Vic. Wasn't that Michael Vic brother name? Let's see what this nigga gave. Yeah, nigga. Well, I don't know. Shout out to Irvine. I appreciate that, my nigga. Irvin. Irvin. Uh, Ranville King again. God damn. Let me see what Ranville says. Ranville King says, Hey, yo, my nigga. I've been missing your lives and not tapping in like I should as of late. But nigga been grinding, trying to get it up. Either way, I just caught your video about what a nothing ass bitch done did to this little nigga dog, man. No words on that for now. I just had to salute you for even covering this piece. Showing love as usual, though. Keep both feet on these motherfuckers' neck, man. Love, nigga. Ranville, I appreciate that. And I appreciate everybody who fuck with that, uh, with that bitch killing the nigga dog and shit like that that video because like unlike niggas man i keep telling like, i'm not no blog i'm not no you know what i'm saying like these niggas can't do videos about other shit that don't concern drake or you know what i'm saying like this shit gonna stay into the rap world and that's what we not doing my nigga we actually trying to build some shit and help people in life it shit ain't, that's why when uh, some rap shit come through, I'm not trying to get all the detail, dog. Nigga died, all good. He died in his hood, all good. I don't give a fuck. You didn't even say his fucking name right, bro. You didn't even say his fucking name right. I don't give a fuck about no motherfucking name. Nigga, the rap trap theory itself. Man, come on. That's why it's in the process of being fucking copyrighted and trademarked. Because that shit. But I appreciate that so much, Ramble. I appreciate that, my nigga. Mello Jones, once again, says, thank you, Ayo. You a real one. I have a question. Do you think black men will have to go to war with black women and kids? and children uh, to reclaim our rightful place within black society? I, I, think, um, I think we're at war at this very moment. It's not about, you know, it, we, we have war at this very moment. We are being, um, but it's not um, black women. It, it's, it's just society. Society is at war with the black man um the best thing for you to do is um the way that we can fight this war because it's a subtle war um when it comes to our relationships really just our relationship our relationship with our children our parents our bitches um and then as far as the, you know, the police, that's an open war. You know that war is going on. That's why you got to record every time you get pulled over. Shout out to all my um, black police officers that are definitely going against the grain and not shucking and jiving, trying to get fucking brownie points. Salute y'all, salute y'all, salute y'all. 
any good police that's not, you know what I'm saying, on that bullshit, I salute you. Because, to be honest, we damn near overdue for a nigga to get killed, you know what I'm saying, by the fucking police. So, um, y'all hold y'all fucking, you know, let's keep our heads down, um, stay focused, um, and let's understand that we can't hold court in the street. Uh, all that yelling and flailing, you're not a, uh, you're not a woman. So they're not going to give you that same respect uh, that they would give a woman. They'll take it so easy on a woman. A woman can hit them and everything and still be alive. Y'all know that we are, you know, actually an endangered species, but they don't, we don't have no protection from the government like animals. It's open season. So we have to be smarter. And that means not riding around smoking weed with guns in the car. Black youngster. Let's be smarter. So the first thing is, if you don't have your shit together, meaning you have your own house, own car, and you have your money is making money, there is no relationship. I wholeheartedly um, co-sign paying a bitch to leave. You understand? You're not, not paying a bitch to fuck, but paying, I, I, I definitely co-sign you paying a bitch to leave. But as far as relationships, without your shit going on, without your shit together, and I don't even, nigga, don't even go too heavy with the paying a bitch to leave shit. Once a week, maybe, you know, it should be, you should have yourself under control to where it's once every two weeks, because any time in between that, you need to be watching Pornhub. If you're trying to get yourself to a place where your money makes money while you're sleeping, we're all broke until we get to that point. So, let's focus up. So, if all of us were on that mindset, the whole woman issue would be fixed on its own, naturally. They'll be too lonely. Like, no, nah, I ain't, I ain't fucking with nothing until I'm, I'm right. But because there's so many stragglers and, and niggas still thinking that they gonna come up off a bitch, living off a bitch, is what happens. And of course, lame niggas fucking the game up also. So you can't get a hoe in line because she's running the shit on a lame motherfucker. So it, it's a whole situation. We'll have to make a whole video about that. But good question, my nigga. Shout out to Melo Jones. Uh, Charles Patton. Charles Patton uh, he doesn't leave a message, but he definitely showed love. Charles, I appreciate that so much, my nigga. Real talk. That's my first time seeing you. Uh, I guess you're new here. I appreciate that, Charles. Um, that guy. That guy, he's not a stranger to the show. I appreciate that, that guy. No message, but he showed love. Matt Haskins. Not a stranger. Shout out to Matt, always showing love, habitual donator, supporter. Uh, Habib Thomas, Habib, Habib, that sound, you know what that sound like. Habib, but I appreciate that, my nigga, either way. I definitely appreciate that, Habib, appreciate that love. Uh, Manya, Ma Manya Thomas, uh, sorry, 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 I'm going to try to take that out, sorry. Manuel Ortiz, once again, Manuel, come through again. I appreciate that, Manuel. Look like you kind of, you know, uh, you probably came in the last two months. I appreciate that love, Manuel. Um, Site L, Site L said, keep spitting facts for the one like for the ones like me who need it. You already know what it is, Site. You know I'm gonna do it. Site L, he's part of the nation. He's always showing love. I appreciate that, Site. Real talk, man. Christopher Hurt. Christopher Hurt said he's supporting the movement. I appreciate that shit, Christopher. Real talk, my nigga. Appreciate that. Uh, D. Will. D. Will says, showing support to your channel. I appreciate that, D. That's, that's my brother nickname. Uh... Anthony Sheets. Anthony Sheets. 
Anthony, uh, you probably want that winning streak too. Um, make sure that I got your uh, email. Make sure you send me your email. Go in this description box and find the email and email me so I can uh, email you what you need, Anthony. I appreciate that love. Lynn Goggins, Lynn Goggins, Lynn Goggins. Um, is that organic soul gumbo? I think that's organic soul gumbo. Lynn Goggins. I, I, I haven't done this, you know, so I, I forgot. Fifth Dimension, Fifth Dimension. Everybody know Fifth Dimension. Fifth Dimension says, proud of the progress, big homie. You already know what it is, Fifth. You already know we're going to keep moving. Innovator J. Innovator J back in the building. Ain't seen a while, Innovator. Good to see you back home. Innovator J didn't leave a message. He just came through with the love. Who we got now? We got um, Site L. Site L says day 10. I know what you're talking about, Site. I know. What you, I don't know if you want me to tell everybody, but I know what you're talking about. Double Up Main. Double Up Main said it's all double up. You know what it is. I know what it is. As long as we got together, it's all love. I appreciate that. I appreciate it, my nigga. You know what it is. Fifth Dimension says salute, big dog. Just because. You already know what it is, my nigga. Darren Sampson. Darren Sampson. I think I see you on, um... Darren, I, 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 I be seeing you on, uh... Facebook and shit like that. Shout out to Darren Sampson. Shout out to Darren Sampson. I appreciate that love, my nigga. He said, uh, keep the pressure on them, fam. I got to do that. You already know. Lawrence Carter. Lawrence Carter says, this is for the new Rap Trap video. Love. I don't, and I wish I knew. Make sure you tell me which one it was so I can, you know, with the references, I like to, uh, know what reference you got it from. Uh, Major. Major show, love. No comment. Uh, Jahad, is that Joey Jahad? Hattie, oh him and Reed Dollars was battling or beefing. Shout out to Jahad. Psych L comes back and says thirty days clean, my nigga. Three S's. Come on, man. Come on, dog. Come on, man. It don't get no better than that. Come on, man. This is, come on. This ain't no fucking vlog channel. This ain't no fucking, you know what I'm saying? Like, this ain't that. This ain't that. This is a whole nother thing. It's a whole nother thing right here, man. Come on. Shout out to you, Site. Shout out to you. Keep fucking going. Keep going. Keep going. Shout out to you, my nigga. 30 days. Oh, come on. Oh, come on, my nigga. That's why I got to go ahead and get this little situation in court out the way so that I can decide what how the three S's book is going to be done, whether it's going to be an audio book or a paperback, but that has to be done. Come on, my nigga. Shout out to you, Sight. Real talk, my nigga. Lawrence Carter comes back and said, let's do this real estate shit. Uh, damn, bro. Episode. He talking about when uh, I was talking about uh, how niggas would do anything as long as it's dumb. But you tell a motherfucker, let's goddamn put some shit together and build something. Nigga find a convenient exit. Like, shit, bro. Goddamn, bro. I wish you would've goddamn said something. I, I was trying to goddamn. That was a no cap video. That was a no cap video. So, Lawrence Carter, you definitely know your shit. Last name on the list. Listen. Listen. Everybody that is supporting what we're doing, you're a Patreon. Make sure you have to be a Patreon. I mean, that that's for you. You know what I mean? Like, we about to do the fifth installment of the How Do I Identify Nothing Ass Bitch series. Um, it's between How Do I Identify Nothing Ass Bitch by her car or How Do I Identify Nothing Ass Bitch by her 
mama, parents, but we're gonna say mama. Um, I think we should do parents. I'm gonna do parents. I'm gonna do parents. Nah, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do mama. I gotta do my. I gotta keep it real. We're gonna keep it real. We're gonna keep it real. I ain't even gonna play with it like that. So, how do I identify nothing ass bitch by a mama, or how do I identify nothing ass bitch by a car? We got the poll going on on Patreon. You have to be a Patreon to actually vote um, for your vote to count. Um, the ballot goes in, um, what is it, the first of the month. So whoever has more comments, you only need to vote one time. Whichever one has more uh, votes through the comment section, that's what we're going to do. Um, and that should be out on Saturday of next week. So, we have the business, man. Everybody that's on this list, you already know what it is with me. You, um, I know what it is with you, obviously. Uh, let's keep moving forward. For everyone who did not hear that name, 